Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Here we are in San Francisco, California. We went from the most crowded, the New York. Let's the second, second? The yeah. second largest Chinatown to the largest Chinatown in the country. In the country, outside so. of yeah, mainland China. Yeah, she was talking about last week we went yeah. to Manhattan, New York, Chinatown. New York, Chinatown, and now we're here in the San Francisco Chinatown. Yeah, this is the biggest uh, Chinatown outside of mainland China. Yeah. It is. Yes. It's like so. 9.45 in the morning. Mm -hmm. We're going to have some dim sum breakfast. Mm -hmm. At Broadway, right across the street. Dim sum cafe. Right there. Uh, right there. Yeah. So uh, we're here for the whole day, spending the night. Mm -hmm. And we have a tomorrow. lot of food options going on. We do. Yeah. So stick around and see what we do. And eat. And eat. We ordered some hagao and sumai. Hagao is with a shrimp in it. Sumai is pork. Like ground pork. Ground pork. And it's about three to four dollars per plate. Yep. Perfect for sharing. This is the uh, the barbecue pork bun. Oh, there we go. It's got paper on the bottom, but it's pretty good. Big pieces, babe. Yeah. Take a bite. Sweet barbecue pork. The outside bun is very soft and fluffy. Mm -hmm. Good. Good flavor. What is this? What kind of soup? It's not soup. This is like a rice corn. Rice corn that has pork in it and preserved eggs. It's very Chinese. This is almost like a, a healthy soup. Yeah. When you're sick, this is what you're supposed to be eating. It's super hot. Yeah. This is the pork dumpling. Good flavor. It's juicy. I, I, I already had it. It has water chestnut in there, so it's a little bit crunchy. Yeah. Perfect, with a little bit of soy sauce. Very good. Yeah. Shrimp dumpling. Full of shrimp. Oh, they have big pieces, huh? This is your favorite, right? That's your favorite. What is it? Pork spare rib with black bean sauce. Over rice. Over. Uh, this one doesn't have rice. Oh, no rice. All right. You can see the pieces of ginger in here. Really good black bean sauce, and you can see it's a spare rib. See, hopefully, I don't burn myself. Really good. Very Asian, very Chinese flavor. Little wrap up of that dim sum place. It was really good. Yeah, yeah it, it was. was uh, it was very authentic tasting. It was. Mm -hmm. Not only that, but everyone was Chinese inside. Yes, and everybody. It seemed like a, a local hangout, definitely. Yeah. Well, what, what were they? Down, what were they saying, babe? Uh, a lot of things. More chow mein, more fried rice. That's what they were saying, baby. Okay, cool. Yeah. Well, luckily our hotel is what a half a mile or About less a mile. than that. No, 0.8 mile. Okay, 0.8 yeah. Mile so there. we're going to walk to the hotel and uh, maybe check in if it's, if it's available. Yeah? Yep, we All are. All right, let's go. Well, that was possibly the longest bridge we ever walked through. That was kind of cool. It was loud in there. I think but it we, was kind of cool. I think we went through at least one time zone. We made it to Ghirardelli Square, mm -hmm. uh, it's our favorite little ice cream yeah. place. It's a really good place, and we are really close to Fisherman's Wharf, which is just right down there. The Alcatraz, it's so clear. Yeah, it's usually it's kind of foggy here, but yeah. it's clear, clear yeah. day today. And he'll show you around the corner. Yep. Successful shopping. Yeah, everybody's a winner. Got a bag full of chocolate. Yay. Yay. Okay, we're at a local brewery. Yeah, San, San Francisco, Francisco Brewery. Yes, cheers. Oh, that's good. That's good. Yeah. A little drink before lunch. 
Okay, it's lunchtime. Lunchtime. It's about a three mile lift ride from where um, we were at Ghirardelli. Ghirardelli. Uh -huh. uh, right behind us is uh, Brenda's Soul Food. Mm, same as Brenda's Meat and Three, which we got our fried chicken. Uh, yeah. It also uh -huh. has another spot. It's Brenda's Soul Food, which is right behind us. And they do serve fried chicken here. Yes. And, uh, you know, uh, we remember this chicken being so good that we rated number two. Yes. Second to Willie Mays Willie in New Mays. Orleans. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I'm hoping it's going to be just as good at this location. So we're going to go find out. First time kind of gumbo here. It is chicken and dewy sausage and okra. It's really good tasting gumbo. Really? How is Very it? Very southern feeling. How is it compared to Nola? It's good. Yeah. It's good. It's a good run for its money. Really? Wow. Mm -hmm. Here we go. This is their famous fried chicken. Look at that cool fried chicken oil down there. Wow. And they give this this sauce. I forgot what it was, but it was like really amazing. A little bit on. Okay, here we go. Look at the juices right here. That is full of juices. Shrimp and grits. It's like a cheese grits, yeah. right? Yeah, see the cheddar cheese grits. That looks really good. Let's try this one first. That's some really good grits. Really good grits. It's a little spicy or not? No, no spice at all. Try the shrimp. It's very good. The sauce on this is amazing. Really? It's really good. I wonder if that's yeah. the same red sauce as the one that's for the chicken. It's some sort of tomato based sauce. Green onions. Matches perfectly. Mm. Mm. That grub was pretty good. That was very good. Yeah. Very good southern It's very good soul food, huh, baby? Yeah, they represent yeah. Uh, New Orleans well. Yeah, they yeah. really do. Really do. Yeah. The shrimp and grits, the grits were so nice and creamy. They were. Really good. The they chicken were. is good. I think still Willie Mays has a beat out. Oh, though, yeah, for sure. For but sure. the chicken was good. It was good. Yeah. Um, I, it was probably a little bit more, I don't know, oilier, I guess, than, than the other bit. Brenda's mm -hmm. location. But yeah. nonetheless, it was flavored well. And uh, I, yeah. I like that little red sauce that comes with it, uh, whatever it is. Everything was just delicious. Yes. So and all together, it was what, 41? 41 bucks. Yeah, 41 dollars. Oh, and the beers were uh, 10 dollars at that last yeah. place. Mm -hmm. They yeah. were. So now we're going to go back to the hotel yeah. and check it Next. out. We're back yep. from our old people nap. Yep, exactly. It's about 6 p.m. Uh, we're here at the what is it, Fisherman's, Fisherman's Wharf, Wharf near Pier 39. Yeah, it's so clear. The Alcatraz, which I'll show you, is really clear. Well, we showed them already, babe. Uh, yeah, but we're going to get closer now. And the bridge, you can actually see San Francisco Bridge. There's no haze, no fog. If you've been here before, usually everything is in a fog. I'm thinking because it's, it's kind of breezy it's here, so it's probably keeping all the, the yeah. fog out. It's pretty cool. We're going to mm -hmm. go look. Krispy Kreme here that has their own line of clothing, like this one right here. Look at Fisherman Wharf. Yeah. They even have aprons, mugs, huge donut area, all the way down. Hi, baby. Hey babe, I found the uh, worst store here in San Francisco. Oh, you did, right across the street, baby. Go Dodgers. Go Dodgers. We are at Pier 39. I know this is probably one of the biggest touristy things, but we haven't been here in a while, so we're going to go check out, see what's new. There's a Nathan's hot right dog here. stand right here. You didn't have to go all the way to New York. But New York was fun. It was.
We're at the end of Pier 39. Yep, cool shot. There's uh, Alcatraz, you can see how clear it is over there. Where is it? Some over there somewhere. It. Yep, it's over there. It's, uh, you can see it here, but it's hard to see it on camera, and it's a clear view of San Francisco Bridge. Yeah, we're gonna check out the sea lions. Yeah, they're stinky. Well, since we're in San Fran, we have to get a bowl of chowder. Yeah. We have definitely. to, a cup. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna pick this place. Chowder is right on Pier 39. Yeah. Try this There's out. so many chowder places here at the. At yeah, the we just picked one. Yeah. Pretty good. Not bad. The clams are good, big pieces. Good tasting chowder. Yeah, it was two dollars less if you didn't get the bread bowl. Mm -hmm. So it was uh, seven, seven, yeah, seven, seven ninety nine. Yep. Mmm. Very creamy. It looks like it's on the watery side, but it's super rich and creamy. And uh, good clam too, good clam flavor. Okay, we got the Biscoff Latte. Latte. Yeah, these are like European cookies. Mm -hmm. Uh, official cookie for Delta Airlines. Yep, these are the ones, the Delta Airlines cookies, and then they crumbled it right on top. They do. With a little bit of whipped cream. Try it out, babe. Oh, that's a good latte. Is it? Mm. We saw them put like a whole spoonful of that. Uh, the cookie butter. The cookie on the butter. Bottom. Those are uh, those jars that uh, you saw. Oh, that's good. Pretty good? This is just like a cookie. Oh, how much was it, babe? This is um, medium. Four, four. Five twelve after tax. Five twelve. Five, five twelve. Pretty good. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're gonna wrap things up here at uh, the Pier 39. Yeah, it's getting kind of cold. Yeah. So we're gonna go back towards our area, which there's a lot of cool little eateries over there. Yep. Go hang out in our area. Yes, it's getting a little cold and yeah. chilly out here. Right near the beach. Water, the water. Yeah, the water. So we found a pretty legit restaurant not far from our hotel. Cross, so baby. Cross. Oh, so good. Yeah, these are the uh, Rattlers. Um, well, half lemonade, half beer, right? Perfect. I got the pan fried trout and I got the Jaeger schnitzel, which is like a pork cutlet with mushroom gravy. Here is my pan fried trout. They wrapped it in bacon. But I never it had good. bacon with trout. With trout. Yeah. And they have some sort of like pesto sauce that's inside with some garlic. There you go. Nice chunky pieces. Oh, that's a very good trout. It tastes like it's deboned. I think they boned it for me. Oh, really? Wow, it's pretty good. Let's cut a piece of this schnitzel. Put the mushroom gravy on it. All right. Mm -hmm. Mushroom gravy. It's so creamy, and the schnitzel is pounded so thin and fried to a golden brown perfection. Look at that! See how thin that is? I'm so full again. It was so good. What? And I think some of these meals are actually the meal that at least he had because I didn't have any fish when I was in Munich. His meal, which you got the schnitzel, right? Yeah, the Jaeger schnitzel. Yeah. It was. It was better than the one we had in Germany. In Munich, so yeah. It was really good. Yeah, this was really legit. Yeah. yeah. So it's it's cool. Cool. Yeah, I, I know there's a lot of food. Okay. okay, better. There we go. Okay. Yeah, so, so. That was a fun time in San Francisco. Yeah, it was a quick overnighter. Yeah. Uh, 
We're leaving early in the morning. Yeah, we have about 9.30 flight back yeah. to LA. Mm -hmm. Only oh, about an hour flight. Uh, reminder, uh, follow our Facebook, Facebook page. page. Uh, and I just posted up the pictures that from our trip today, I just posted up on Facebook. Yeah, so it just gives you an idea of where we are. Mm -hmm. So when it comes time to Wednesday, Thursday, when the vlog comes up, you already got a heads up, right? Yep. Yes. That's it. That's it. All right. Thanks again for watching our San Francisco adventure. Catch you guys on the next one.